Jimmy J. Lee of Jackson, Mississippi, graduate of Murrow High School and well known for his spirited personality, caring attitude, and his proud involvement within the LGBT community, now presumed dead. Was this an act of hate or a crime of passion? Welcome to Crimes Among Us. After graduating, Jimmy would head to Oxford to the University of Mississippi, majoring in public policy, excited about building his resume and helping those in need. Jimmy would begin an effort to provide formula to the families that needed it. After a startling dream, Jay Lee records a TikTok. He recalls having a hookup with a sneaky link that he had not hooked up with since the summer of 2020. After a undesirable situation presents itself, Jimmy decides to leave. The man in a dream attempts to end Jimmy's life. This eerie dream gains traction when on July 8th, 2022, after leaving Campus Walk's apartments in Oxford around 5.58 a.m., Jimmy Lee goes missing. 48 hours later, his 2014 Ford Fusion was found at a local towing company. The towing company tells authorities that it was picked up from Molly Bar Trail's apartment complex. Early Friday afternoon, the same day, Jimmy went missing. 13 days later, community members and students of the University of Mississippi rallied in support of Jimmy. Oxford Police, the State Attorney General, the students, even the FBI joins in on the search. Friday, July 22nd, a shocking discovery. Jimmy is not found. However, his classmate, Timothy Harrington, is arrested and charged with his murder, igniting a statewide debate. How can authorities charge for murder without a body? Harrington's attorney, Uncle Judge Carlos Moore, says his client is innocent practicing law over 20 years and never once hearing of anyone being charged with murder without proof of death. And then the affidavit is released. On or about the 8th day of July 2022, Timothy feloniously and willfully and unlawfully with deliberate decision to affect the death of Jimmy Lee. Justice for Jay Lee will be heard August the 9th at the bond hearing at 10 a.m. For more on this story and others like it, please take a second, click this link, and subscribe to my YouTube.